Mr. Chairman, thank you for um, being here, Ms. Richards. Um, Planned Parenthood Action engages in political activity. Is that correct? The Planned Parenthood Action Fund, which is a separate corporation, does. And you are compensated by that organization? Well, I mean, my, I get compensation uh, really to reimburse for my yes costs. No. I, for brevity. I'm just trying to explain. I'm sorry. Yeah, I understand, and I, I, I know how these things work, but the answer is yes or no, and I think you have already answered it. It is, what, 31000 Is that about right? I don't have the figures for last year, but whatever my compensation was, it is for work that I do on behalf of the Action Fund. Okay, where does Planned Parenthood Action get its funding? Uh, private donations. We have 8 million supporters in this country and a number of uh, donors from all over, all over the country. And there's, is there any money from uh, Planned Parenthood that goes to uh, Planned Parenthood Action? There, not, n there is the Planned Parenthood Action Fund, which is, it does advocacy and it does electoral work. There is advocacy. But that, I know what they do. I'm asking. Well, I think I'm, I'm trying to be responsive to your I know, question. But, but, but right? for brevity's so, sake so, and, and out of respect, well, for brevity's sake. For 60, as you know, for 501c4 organizations, they cannot do a majority of their work as elect, electoral work. That's under IRS code. And so more than 60, that. I think between 65 and 70 percent of the work of the Action Fund is non electoral. Okay, you also have a PAC. Is that correct? Okay. Yeah, I was just going to one. Yeah. yeah. Yes, there is a there right. is a federal right. pack, and um, and that uh, federal pack. How much? Just round figures. Uh, what did it spend in 2014? How much the federal pack spent in 2014? I can get that for you. Okay. I'm not being evasive. It's obviously right. public record. I just don't have it with me. Where do they? Where does the pack get its money? It raises its money from individuals. Are you compensated? Um, and sometimes, uh, are you compensated by the pack? I don't believe I have any have ever been compensated by the PAC, although I know that the federal law requires if you are doing work on behalf of a federal candidate, I believe you actually have to, your time has to be paid for by a PAC. So we follow all the laws and Do you, do you have the, any all oversight the over the PAC? Do you have any oversight over the PAC, any managerial responsibility? Sure. I mean, in the okay. sense that everything Then you are supposed to be compensated if you do any work for the PAC. And you need to check that out. Well, I, I, just, um, I think I, I want to go to this. In 2004, you founded a group called America Votes, a coalition of 42 national grassroots organizations focused on elections. How many of these organizations collaborate with or are incorporated into Planned Parenthood's political operation? I'm sorry, you're asking me about a job I had before Planned Parenthood. That is, is that correct? correct? That okay, but can you on restate, sorry, could you restate the question? We're just out of. I was just out of context. How many of these organizations are collaborating with or have been incorporated into Planned Parenthood's political operation? I really don't know. I, so I would assume that some do because you can't answer. It's either a yes or no. Some have, or they're either there I, or they're not. I really don't. Well, I think you asked me how many, and I said I don't know. Right. I think Let me, a lot of these organizations work together. Um, but I don't. You know, I, and I could get you. I mean, we could we could get more information for you. That would be helpful. Um, you, you've got these high-paid executives. There's, interestingly enough, uh, 44 of your highest-paid executives make more than any cabinet member. 28 of them make more than any member of the cabinet. You got that, that's over 200,000. You got another 11 make over 300,000. That's more than anybody in the cabinet, any Supreme Court justice, the Chief Justice, the Vice. Oh. Uh, I don't the think Vice President, you've got four that make more than the President, not counting you. Are any of them uh, expected to make political contributions? By by who? I'm sorry. By you? No. Do you direct political contributions to candidates? The PAC does. Yes, but do you have any input it. in who gets? No, but there is a PAC committee that votes on this. Are, are you on that PAC question, committee? I'm trying to respond. Are, are you on that PAC committee? I'm not on the PAC committee. Do you have any input into who gets political contributions? No, the PAC committee votes on who so, gets political so contributions. So there's no no collaboration between you and the PAC committee. You're setting I don't. I haven't. Record. I haven't sat on a PAC committee meeting for for a long time. Um, All right. Let me. But ask you. I mean. And, your PAC we operate advertises itself. absolutely. A, you know, we meet the federal laws and restrictions. I, I, I appreciate the, how you want to answer this. Um, your PAC advertised itself as being nonpartisan. Yet in 2014, 100 percent of the contributions went to Democrats. In 2012, 99 percent went to Democrats. I actually and don't believe that's accurate. That's, but that's what's reported here. Okay. Well, okay. I'll go back and look. But All right. we, we support. We've done work on behalf of. Um, uh, we I support anyone who supports women's rights. Mr. Chairman, I, I'm reclaiming my time. Um, 
I just want to point out that it's not nonpartisan and that you've given almost, I mean, in every case, almost every dime to Democrats, including to nine members of this committee. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Well, we welcome any Republican who supports women's rights and women's health care access, and so thank you. Gentleman, gentleman yields back.